everybody. Uh, it's Dale with Never Enough Diving. Uh, we're going to do something a little bit different today. Um, we are coming to the end of lobster season and grouper season already ended so it's probably going to be uh, less diving videos and more um, other kind of videos. Uh, I'm also a contractor. I do mostly window replacements. I do some roofing, some remodeling and I have a um, I have a brand new work trader that I'm going to be setting up, and I wanted to uh, I wanted to make the work trader uh, have electricity that I could just I don't want a, a major power plant in there. I just want to be able to charge my uh, batteries for my cordless tools. Um, and I have used Renogy before. Um, I used it on my shed build, which I did not. Uh, video or YouTube, but uh, Renogy is a pretty cool company. They do not sponsor me. They, they have nothing to do with this video. Um, they just happen to be a company that I tried before. And I really liked the way they set their kits up. So um, today I'm going to be unboxing the solar panels. It's a 200 watt kit that comes from Renogy and the chickens want to be on the uh, video. So um, it's a 200 watt kit and in the kit, um, you get two 100 watt solar panels. Um, you get a charge controller. I think it's the Wanderer version of the charge controller, which I haven't used yet. Uh, and you get some other stuff. So let's unbox it and see. I have I have the kit here, and then I have the inverter here, and I have a a Renogy lithium iron. I've been calling it ion, but it says iron on it. So it's a lithium iron phosphate battery. Um, they're quite expensive, but they are, um, they are amazing batteries as far as, uh, their life and all that stuff. Um, so let's get started unboxing this and see what we got here. And I'm going to try to salvage the box in case, uh, I'm trying to remember, but I think uh, I think there was a bad panel um, on, on the kit I bought before, and I had to I had to send it back. But, uh, they honored it. Um, actually, they sent me a new one before I even sent the uh, old one back. So, Renogy has been pretty pretty good to work with as far as uh, customer service and stuff like that. They're available. Uh, I think they're based in California is a necessary good thing, but when you call them, for it's been my experience, you do get someone that is in California that is easy to understand and all that stuff. So this is uh, the first solar panel. Okay. So you have the solar panel. These things are amazingly light. They're, they're not heavy at all. Um, you can actually even see, <clears throat> see the light through them. Um, you've got the the, the, the wiring and the plugs um, and somewhere in here is probably a there's a special plug that um, you can as you put more panels together you have to use that so that's one solar panel and this box is going to have all the goodies in it the other solar panel everything looks to be in order so far and uh, this kit is this kit is an RV kit, um, and I think the only difference with the RV kit is it comes with this guy, um, and this is what you use to uh, you drill your holes, and then this goes over it. I don't know if we have to glue it down or something. I'll figure that out later. So we have that. Oh, and then we have here's your charge controller. And this is these these systems are so easy to use. Um, oh, it says adventure. I don't know if that's uh, actually that. Actually, I know that is better than the Wanderer because um, the Wanderer does not have this LCD display. I think this is LCD. LCD. Yeah, it's LCD. Um, it doesn't have the LCD uh, display. It just has some lights. So um, I would say this is an upgrade from the Wanderer. Uh, I'm not 100 sure what this is. 
fire. Oh, this is probably all the uh, mounting hardware for the solar panels. Yeah. Um, so basically, you you mount these to the panel itself, um, and then this screws down onto your mounting surface. So that's about it that's in here. Um, cords, I'm not sure what that is. We'll figure that out along the way as well. We might have to read, we might have to read some instructions along the way. Uh, by the way, we have a cameraman today that sticks uh, Kyle Dillon behind the camera. He does all of our editing. There he is. How's it going? He does all of our editing for Never Enough Diving. Not all of it, most of it. I do most of the shorts. He does most of the longer videos. Um, this is one thing I really like about Renogy. They pre-strip the wires and leave the little plastic on. It's super, super easy. Um, it keeps it from being, you know, it keeps you from overcutting if you have to strip it yourself. Uh, and it makes it really easy to keep everything nice and tight. Um, so that's the solar kit. That's what you get. Um, with the uh, with the Renogy 200 watt RV uh, kit, so I think this might be a, like a Bluetooth or something. Yeah, this is a Bluetooth module which I didn't even know I was getting. Uh, I may or may not even use that. Um, I don't really care once I get it set up with this battery uh, and 200 watts of uh, solar panels. Uh, we are in in, in Central Florida, so um, solar panel. We're in a pretty optimum. Uh, environment for solar so I'm not really worried about not having enough power um, or really even monitoring it I'm hopefully there's enough monitoring on here I kind of like to set it and forget it uh, so I have not I don't even remember what brand I ordered on this uh, inverter and I think I got a 2000 watt inverter and we'll see. Uh, I have to do the math on um, on on what our uh, what our chargers are going to be using. Um, and I'm being very careful with this not to cut into anything, which is probably good because all that stuff is up there on the top. Oh, I got a Renogy. <laughs> I guess I got a Renogy inverter. That's interesting. I don't. I'm not sure what that is. Um, these are pretty self-explanatory. These are going to go from the battery to uh, the inverter. So we have a 2000 watt inverter and it's a pure sine wave inverter. Pure sine wave. I can't remember uh, what that actually means, but I do know that it's, it's much better than the other kind. Uh, and I, oh, I do want to say too, I'm not like, I am not a solar expert or even an electrical expert. So this is basically for maybe informational purposes with the stuff. Um, but I'm, I'm not, I'm not a, I'm not a certified electrician or anything. So uh, I would not recommend uh, using any of this for anything technical. Uh, make sure you read all your instructions. Um, once you get this juice, into this thing, um, it will turn it into 110, I believe. Um, so it can't hurt you. Uh, I don't know if it can kill you, but it can hurt you for sure. Um, you can get the crap shot out of you. Uh, so just make sure you read all your instructions and be safe. Uh, and we're going to we're going to move to the trailer and and see about mounting it on the top. I have I haven't even gone up there to see what we're dealing with yet, um, but we'll figure it out and we'll be back with you.